Hello traders, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today was an excellent day, especially if you are an option seller, right? India VIX crashed more than two, uh, more than three and a half percent. That is really good for an option seller. In spite of negative global queues, in spite of uh, negative local queues, also Adani issue is also still active. It is not yet done today. Also, Adani Enterprises. Uh, went down by more than three and a half percent. We'll see more of that. Even FIAs are still having big short positions, and uh, they have uh, unwinded some short position. Uh, and uh, yesterday also we told that market may consolidate, right? So we'll see about that. Before that, uh, if you are interested in market, we have a very vibrant Telegram group where we discuss many things about stock market, price action and so on and so forth. So if you are interested, you can join the Telegram group for which the link is on the description below, right? So markets were kind of, uh, I wouldn't say volatile, it was moving zigzag, right? So there is, uh, you know, there is a concept called boxing concept called dancing rose, right? So it is, it was like dancing rose. So all day long, what it did, uh, it did was, <clears throat> it was moving up and down. Now I was thinking bank nifty, I, in terms of nifty, when it comes to in terms of nifty, I thought today 17,750 uh, levels will be broken. In fact, uh, today morning, once the market opened, that is what exactly happened. Nifty tried to close below 17,750 levels, but it couldn't close below 17,750 levels. That was very unfortunate. I thought if it has, if it had gone below 17,750 levels, maybe we will short some call options. Anyway, even without doing that, uh, India Vix uh, helped us uh, uh, helped us a lot. In fact, to be honest with you, I'll tell you, our members who are registered in mentorship program are in a good profit, maybe 50k profit, 50,000 profit, right? So if you want to join the mentorship program, I will leave the link in the description below. You can join or if you are not interested, there is a so the mentorship telegram support group where you can find how our members are uh, making money right so as far as the market is concerned now hopefully maybe uh, monday uh, saturday sunday this is a weekend monday maybe we will gap down uh, markets are really us markets are really in the red uh, dow jones s p nasdaq everything is uh, down by half a percent nasdaq is more than uh, down by half a percent uh, FTSE, uh, German uh, and France is also down by uh, one to half a percent. So there is uh, uh, global queues are really negative. So the probability of market going on the downside is very, very high, right? Now you can understand or you might know that yesterday I told maybe I actually we put a thumbnail that uh, maybe we will have to go long uh, because FIAs are reducing their index a short position today also they have reduced we'll talk about that but who knows maybe it is a trap see this uh, index future or uh, institution activities is end of the day data so eod means end of the day data means it's a lagging indicator right so we are referring to a data which is already done which is already history we are getting end of the day data. We don't know what they are going to do on Monday. Maybe they will add uh, short uh, futures, more short futures that we really don't know. But that's why I'm saying you will have to take this as a reference only, but you shouldn't uh, rely on these data, right? So we'll see what happens. Uh, hopefully Monday, uh, if I'm right, my perspective, my view is, see, I'm not arguing with you. I'm not telling market is going to go up or market is going to go down. I'm telling my perspective. My perspective is that market may go down. Looking at the price action, markets are really weak. It is not even able to cross 17,900, which is a crucial resistance. So that is for Nifty. And when it comes to Bank Nifty, uh, Bank Nifty all day long, it was zigzag movement only. That's why I told had you done a short straddle or uh, if you are an option seller you would have made excellent money right so we took our members from uh, we took some trades before uh, budget 
budget is done even when budget was there our members were holding on to the position uh, then you imagine how much caliber i should have right i am trading plus i am guiding at least 50 or 60 people to do trade right so everybody is in profit that is the main problem that's why i, al- I always used to say i don't care where the market is go- uh, goes all i care about is uh, i am profitable and my members are profitable right so bank nifty is kind of sideways now what i can see is maybe on the downward trajectory we'll have to move this line slightly on the upper side maybe this levels yeah maybe this level right yeah this level maybe 14300 or 14400 might be the next support that is what i think uh, looking at the markets being uh, it is uh, just uh, simply weak there is no support from heavy weights so market may consolidate on and it may go on the downside so that is what is my anticipation uh, let us see if uh, my anticipation works or not right apart from that if you see the participant wise uh, uh, details fia if you fia futures why i am pointing this uh, index future shorts is because it is very important uh, component whether you of course there are many derivatives there are long uh, call uh, call options there are put options uh, call long call short uh, put long put short there are so many things but future uh, short or future long is very very important now if you had seen our video yesterday uh, there were around 136000 active contracts that is future index shorts were active in uh, nifty futures now they have reduced it to 124000 day before yesterday it was uh, 136000 yesterday it was 132000 today it is 124000 and future index long they have added day before yesterday it was around 22000 yesterday it was around 24000 today it is around 29000 so they are unwinding in uh, short positions and adding it in long position future long position right so still they are having a pretty huge amount of shorts in the market and as i told you this is just a lagging indicator we might not uh, get uh, correct data this data might not be correct because this is a lagging data we might have to see how things pan out we will have to wait so all these things whatever i'm saying is just for reference only and uh, fia to my surprise today they have bought for 100458 crores and dais have sold for around 291 crores this is what i see in the market so we'll see what happens to the market how it spans and uh, this adani issue is a whole story people are still are talking about adani if you see the adani stock from acc to ambuja cement ambuja cement was up by half a percent acc was down by 1.5% 1.71% adani enterprise was down by 3.86% i don't know how people are trading in adani day before yesterday it was down by 24 yesterday it was up by 25 uh, then i think sorry yeah it was uh, yesterday it was down by 11% and today it is down by almost 4% adani green is down by 5% adani ports and special economic zone was up by half a percent adani power adani total gas adani transmission adani wilmer so everything is down by 5% to 1 and 2% so it's all about adani whether it's in our parliament or <laughs> whether it's in our telegram group people fight about uh, talk more so, so much about adani right so see it is not political see i am not uh, trying to defend me but i am saying you not only in indian parliament even in uk parliament house of commons uh, mps have raised this issue about adani right so uh, when uh, gordon brown was a prime minister uh, i i think his uh, brother in law or some uh, relative were uh, tapering some uh, loans or uh, he, they did something so that issue was uh, taken out in house of commons also so this is not political this is about uh, how adani is manipulating how adani is uh, making things uh, 
in his favor right so we'll see how things pan out uh, i hope you uh, enjoyed this video have a nice weekend i'll see you in another video till then take care bye